G'day everybody, my name's Brendan. I'm a strategic planner at the city of Greater Bendigo, and today I'm presenting from Jar Jar Run Country. One of the many reasons we love buses is because they're adaptable. They don't need fixed infrastructure like rails to operate, and we can modify their routes when we need to. Well, that's the theory anyway, but we've found making small changes to our bus network is incredibly difficult, a process that seems to be covered in red tape. In Bendigo, all buses are now funneled down Mitchell Street. The blue lines on this map behind me show bus routes with the weight of the line proportionate to how many buses there are per hour. A relatively small change that we have been asking for is splitting the city centre coverage evenly so that our main streets share the load. This will result in much better coverage of our city centre while still maintaining the central interchange at the train station. Having a nimble and adaptive bus network is important as it can respond to a changing urban environment. We are seeing big changes in the northern end of our city centre with the construction of our new law courts, Gov Hub and TAFE redevelopment, all shown on this map. This will generate thousands of new trips to this area every day. So having a bus network that reflects this from day one is important as it will be during a time when people will start reforming travel behaviors. This will also help alleviate the bus congestion and pressure that many waiting passengers have on narrow footpaths in Mitchell Street. I love catching the bus to get around, but the environment in Mitchell Street isn't very pleasant and there has been three separate occasions where I've missed a bus because of an early departure. This is partially because the congested corridor can put pressure on buses waiting in the dynamic bay to leave early. Although this isn't the only thing we'd like to change in our public transport system, we feel like it is one of the most simple changes to make. PTV and the department could be doing more to work with local governments and communities when there needs to be minor changes made to the network like this.